次はあの技で次はあの技で私が守ってみせる頑張れ私ファイトを仕掛けるよ一気にするうまくいった その程度かナンダクさん強すぎ今だ好機を逃すなチワキ肉を取るなはっはっ一気に攻めるはっそこもあれやふっふっキャクラエッエイちゃんこれまたねマンジラを認めよう私とアルベスなら当然よ
気づかれてしまったわ、ミノト。無念です、日のエネル様。完璧に気配を消していたのに。完璧な忍び足だったのに。さすがはカムラの里でも、指折りのつわもの。まだまだ、私たちは修行不足のようです。まあ。え勝手に入ってきちゃダメ嫌ですわ。同じ里のよしみ、家族のようなものじゃないですか。そんなことより佐藤佐があなた様をお呼びです支度が済んだら出発いたしましょう
りますよ日の江、ミノト、ご苦労たった今、フミが届いたぞ近々、百竜夜行が起こるそうだ<笑>ついに、始まってしまうのですね<笑>うん五十年前に佐藤を襲ったあの悲劇一時も忘れたことはないあまたのモンスターすなわち百竜その大襲来すなわち夜行原因不明の災いにカムラの里存亡の危機近いうちに砦で遠征することになるだろう佐藤を守らねばならんご心配には及びません佐藤さん私たちカムラの民が日々修行を重ねてきたのはまさにこの時のため<笑>姉様早速準備に取り掛かりましょう<笑>うん<笑>頼もしい限り。その前にああまずはあちら。いらっしゃいませ。うん。うんうん。お次は。おう、教師はどうだ。<笑>さて。うん。うん、次で、さい、そうそう。<笑>
やあマナ弟子待っていたよそれじゃあのよせいぶじゃあ、I'm、I'm just starting a challenge today I'm gonna try to beat the game under two mods one is let me see if I can showcase it right now yeah uh one is if you look at my character uh, stats right now on the screen you will notice that it says I have a hundred stamina but it says that I have one HP Yeah, I am permanently permanently locked to one HP this entire game, this entire save file. And also, there's another mod that I have to set up that is gonna make it so any quest that I do only allows for one faint. So the moment I faint, I gotta I gotta redo the entire quest. Doesn't matter when the faint happens, cause I don't know. I mean, sunbreak. Like Rai, Sunbreak is supposed to be the easiest monster hunter, so why not push it to the limit to see if it's true? Uh, I just wish we could skip this tutorial. Uh, I just wanna set up everything and, and move on to see how, how terrible this is gonna be. Oh, 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 that, that, that's cute. Wow, that's a lot of stuff. Uh, can I? Okay, finally. Okay, let's start here. Uh, tutorials, no. Targeting arrow, hide. Can't wait for the rampage quest. Uh, yeah, uh, not gonna lie. I only, like, like, I only thought on, on this quest, like, from the, from the perspective of, like, a normal hunt. Like, as, as in how potentially annoying it would be. I didn't consider for a second, like, I didn't even thought about the Rampage quest. Like, mmm, those has way, those have, like, way too much potential to be insufferable. Thank God, I, we, I, like, I only have to suffer through them, you know, on the base game, like, right now. And the moment the base game is over, it's, whoo, see ya. Never see them again, but, yeah, Rampage might be insufferable. I think this is how I usually set up my stuff. I'm, um... Yeah, this is how my stuff usually looks. We could like uh, you could like uh, save all this stuff, you know, like just like you can save the preset of your characters visually. I wish you could do the same for this.
Because now I gotta go like one by one to make sure that it's the same stuff as, as my main save file. Okay, I think everything looks good. Oh my god, this part. Uh, I should have double checked my camera speed uh, on the other side, but I'm pretty sure I always go for very fast. I mean, why am I putting uh, I don't know why I'm configuring the, the, the gunner stuff, because um, I'm gonna say it right now. Range weapons are ba are banned on this channel for uh, on this challenge. Sorry for obvious reasons. Like playing with a range weapon will just give me will just give me like a chance to you know cheese fights that I may find and you know whatever or cheese the challenge itself. So yeah, no bug no bogans nor bows on through this entire challenge. It's gonna be melee only. I think that's good I think that's good uh, now I need to set up the, the mod which should be somewhere around here uh, ah here it is we move this slider down to one and now any quest I enter should be a one faint quest only like one card and that's it start from the start start from the beginning okay oh yeah um i also have a mod that lets me unlock a layer armor way earlier than you normally should and that's because i value my drip too much like despite this being a challenge and i mean it's just layer armor you know it doesn't affect gameplay so Oh, but I just noticed. I unlock layer armor, but I don't unlock the the recolor. Uh, that's gonna be annoying, especially because this scarf is not a matching. It's not gonna match the stuff. But well, whatever, I'll worry about that later. Uh, first, let me change weapons. Ooh, I can change my yeah. I gotta wait a little bit to be able to uh, change. Switch skills. I hope. I hope that the vanilla uh, set of skills for dual blades is what I think it is in my mind. Because if it's not, oh brother, I'm gonna suffer. I'm gonna suffer way early than I than I thought. Uh, that's it. That I claim everything. El mano Jackson, que lo que de lo mío. I mean, what's up, brother? Okay, start with the sisters. Oh my god. I hope there is no part of the tutorial that requires you taking damage because, you know, for them to teach you how to heal and whatever, because I don't remember. Because it's gonna be funny if, <laughs> if the challenge ends right there. I'm good, my man. Great to know, bro. Uh, I hope I can say the same after this first day of the challenge uh, finishes. Because, oh boy. I get a terrible feeling that I am severely underestimating, like, how how terrible this challenge will be. Ah, there it is. Yep. One HP. L look at that beauty. Look at all that HP that I have. Ah. 
And you know what's the, what's the best part about this mod? Because the mod, it's, it's not that it's lowering my HP to 1, but it's putting my max HP to 1, meaning that the, the max amount of HP, like, like the only amount of HP that you can have is 1, because 0 is dead, no? Duh. But uh, what I want to make clear by that is that I'm going to be playing the entire game at 1 HP, but I can't abuse any of the skills that, you know, that gives you an advantage for, for being, like, low HP. For example, Dragon Heart, that gives you, like, a lot of Dragon Attack and Raw Attack for playing, like, below 70% HP. Or the Foot Skill uh, Adrenaline, that also does something similar. Like, I can't use those. Because I, I have 1 HP, but it's 1 max HP, so I can't use anything. In fact, I, I was testing... And despite the, the red HP that you can see on the screen right now, I also can't use like resentment. I can't use resentment. Also, I can't use I can't use the skill berserk. If I use the skill berserk, the second I change into the blue scroll, I in you insta cart. And not only do you insta cart, uh, because I I like I tested this on a on a gathering quest. I was able to see this. If you change into the blue scroll, if you change into the blue scroll with Berserk at 1 HP, you get trapped in a loop of death. Like, your character dies, and because, you know, it's a gathering quest, because it's a gathering quest, um, and you have, like, a no limit faint, right? You cart, go back to the camp, get over, and because you're still in the blue scroll, you die again, and you repeat that loop. If you <laughs> spam the chain scroll a lot, you can get away, but it's like, it's kind of precise, like, it's not enough to just blindly spamming it. <laughs> it's actually yeah. fucked up. Not even a Strife? No. I can't use a Strife because a Strife is the yeah. element version of Resentment. Like, they require you to have an amount of red HP. And again, the red HP that you see on the screen right now, is like a visual bug. The game is not counting that as a red, as red HP. That's just a, a bug because of, you know, the mod artificially setting my max HP to 1. Mm. Now, you know, there is something that I hope I can discover right now in this tutorial, and something that I couldn't test. I didn't <laughs> test if the Spirit Burst can override the mod and, like, up my HP over 1. Because that's gonna be a whole new layer of annoying if they do. I hope they don't. But, uh, let's see. The Stamina 1's work will work normally because i'm not touching stamina but uh let's see ah there's one for hp okay let's confirm if this does maxes my hp i'm gonna be so annoyed come on i am still one hp let's go let's go yep okay i am 100 locked at one hp i can't do nothing because uh, when I went to the when I went to the to the Garden Quest to test, I also took like food bu buffs, and food also doesn't increase the, the HP. So yeah, I can't increase the HP on anyway. That's that's good. That's good. And also, you notice how the red HP got a little lower. Like again, it's just because. It's just because uh, it's, it's just visual box, you know, because of uh, using a mod and whatever. <laughs> like, regardless of what happened, I'm locked to 1 HP. Oh boy, this is the part that I'm fearing. Okay, I have the spinning. Okay, I have this attack. That, that's all I need. That's all I need with, with uh, Dual Bliss. I am so scared. I'm so scared of these guys because I feel like at any moment one of them is gonna chip me and you already know what happens. Like, you know how the start of the game should be like a breeze? It should be like really easy? Bro, I think the start of the game is gonna be the worst part of this challenge. Because you know that at the start of the game is where you get all the raptors and all the monsters that to compensate that they are weak around themselves with the, like smaller monsters bro smaller monsters are gonna be like the biggest enemy they are gonna be the biggest enemy in this challenge because it might be like they're fully focused on the big monster and then bang as stupid as a small monster like names you and you're dead 
God, man. I'm gonna silence up for that thing. <laughs> Rise your HP. <laughs> Oh my god. Uh. Oh, what the fuck was that? <laughs> Wrong bottom. What? That was weird. Nice that I didn't instantly open the map, but whatever. Come on, let's finish the tutorial. I wanna fight. I want the real game to begin. Can I? Oh, okay, this mod still works. Nice. Okay. My first objective on this challenge is uh, we need to kill Akuluyaku as soon as possible. And why, you might ask? Why, you might ask? That I have to kill a Kuluyaku as soon as possible? <laughs> For the whole reason that I installed a mod to unlock layer armor early. So I can get Luna's iconic uh, fox tail and ears. Like, I need to get that as soon as possible. Luna is dead as naked without us. Drip or drown. You could Your video is super clear for sure. I'm viewing it in 4K. Really? Wait, you're viewing it in 4K? Mm, Do you have like YouTube Premium or something? Cause I'm pretty sure I like on my end I'm only offering my streaming uh, up to 2K, and it's not even like true. It's not even like true 2K. It's just a uh, upscale 2K. Cause a little trip for any of you that is listening to this stream and wants to like <laughs> upload uh, videos to YouTube. Ooh. Never upload the stuff below 1080p. Because YouTube is gonna give you like a super garbage uh, codec that is gonna destroy the quality of your video. You have to always upload and stream stuff at 2K or more, uh, 1440p or more. Because when you do that, uh, you force YouTube to give you a, a different codec that keeps the, your stuff really high quality. That keeps you as close as whatever you're giving it as possible. Okay, we got the... Bro, <laughs> I'm looking at this Jagras quest and I'm dead as, I, I'm dead as scared. <laughs> but I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do one of these two. Uh, let's do this one. Let me put up the music while while we do the, the boring stuff. Yeah, the quality is massively clear. That's good. That's especially good because uh, YouTube did something these days. I don't know what they did. But they did something and I have to lower the quality that I usually do to a stream. Like the, the bitrate, you know, the bitrate that defines like how, how good the quality stays under movement. Um, I was streaming like a certain quality that based on YouTube like recommended settings, it's like the mass that I could push, like it's the maximum that I could push my, uh, my setup. But um... I don't know what happened that I was streaming like that and suddenly it began lagging like super hard and disconnecting the stream. Mm. So I was like, okay, fuck it. And I lower it to like the, to a more middle ground amount. So that's that. Mm -mm -mm. Uh, what am I gathering again? I like, I like completely blanked out. I like completely black out. What am I gathering again? Oh my god, there is a Jagras. <laughs> no! I'm scared. I'm scared of the lizard. Oh, I remember now what I'm gathering. Yeah, yeah, I remember, I remember, I remember, I remember. <laughs> Bro, everything is <so> scary now. <laughs> Okay, I remember now. Let me get back here. I need to go up here. Hey, see you know what's up, bro? <laughs> Quality is massively clear. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. 
Okay, here we go. Dead shrooms. Man, it's been a while since I did a gathering quest. I even forget those are still in this game. Uh, okay, there's nothing useful here. Let me keep going. But yeah, like, uh, the biggest challenge on this quest. Sorry, the biggest challenge, like, in my mind, on through this challenge, right? Like, what I think is gonna be the worst. Oh my god, 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 oh my god. <laughs> I think the worst is gonna be the rampage quests and some of the arena quests. Like some of the big monsters, like guys Magorn and uh, Ibushi, Narwa, like those guys, I feel especially a match. Like, I didn't think about him while uh, thinking on the quest, like while thinking on the challenge. But I now I'm thinking, like, dude, oh my god, what am I gonna do with Amatsu? Like, Amatsu has so many moments through the fight. That if you are not like right beside uh right beside uh one of the great wire box to launch you in the air, you take cheap damage. And I can't take mm. cheap damage. The moment I take cheap damage, dead. The funniest thing is when the cat attacks you and steals your swag. <laughs> uh, I I I love those those black apalicos. The ones that I steal from you. That shit is so funny. Okay, gathering quest done. Now, Let's suffer and go for the Jagras quest. Oh boy. Let's go for the Jagras quest. <laughs> if I card on this quest, on that quest, that's gonna tell you everything about how much I'm gonna suffer through the rest of through the through, through the rest of the the challenge. Cause am I dying dying to literally the first thing that can aggro you? Who couldn't be me? Couldn't be me. Oh I forgot I almost forgot. Give me a second guys. Because I don't have a proper uh, UI for it And I don't want to put it like on the screen and be annoying I'm not gonna have it on like on the screen, okay? But I am gonna make a card count Okay, okay, now, now I have something to count <laughs> I'm gonna keep a card count I wanna count like how many times I'm gonna card through this like challenge been doing good taking a break from Skyrim so many bugs come on bro but bugs are like half of the experience what do you mean you're tired of the bugs oh my god there's the final boss here Dude, look at him. Look at him. I swear to you, this challenge won't end with a Bulfango carting me, like, in the worst possible timing. I, that, like, that clip is bound to happen. At this point, the question is, it's not, like, if it's going to happen or not. It's if it's gonna be funny or not, you know? At this point, that's the, that's the question. By the way, I haven't checked. What is my loadout? I haven't checked it. Wait. Because I don't have the demon, the flurry rush, but I have. Okay, I have this thing and. And I have my counter. Okay, perfect. That's. That's the perfect loadout for base rise. I'm, I'm glad the developers knew. That's the perfect loadout. Like, the only thing that you can get requires you the scroll change, which is, which is you know, having the counter in the main scroll and the sharpening uh, silk by move on the other scroll. Yes. That's the only over that I could make. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 
like enemies not dying like and they are super and they're supposed to <laughs> ah when they when like when you exhaust their hp and they still like stay standing and the game and the game like even dares to recognize them as, as dead like it can it lets you loot but they are moving and attacking you that's fun i have had bugs like that <laughs> Uh, buddy, where is he going? Wow, my man changed like zip codes <laughs> moving away from me. Bulfango, the last boss, bro. I swear, man, like, I swear the small monsters are gonna be the MVP of this challenge. No, not the big monsters. Like, carting to the big monsters is gonna be like, ah, whatever. I made a mistake, you know? I was greedy, that's why I got hit. But when you're focused on a big monster, and a small monster pop pops up out of nowhere, like, hi! <laughs> And cards, you, and cards me like, oh man, that's when I'm gonna pop off. Oh, th that's when the Spanish lessons are gonna begin on, on live on stream. <laughs> that's when you guys are gonna learn a whole lot of Spanish that you probably shouldn't know. Oh my God, you guys saw it, right? I almost jump into that Jagras. Like, I almost, like, jump straight into his mouth. <laughs> like, the hairball is not going down a lot of the time one shot me. I mean... Low-key, that just sounds like playing, uh... Like, playing on, on survival. And being like, and, you know, and being, and being like lower level than what you're fighting. That honestly just sounds like that. Because I don't know what anyone else is going to try to gaslight me. Uh, but uh, all Bethesda games, no exception, have terrible, and I mean terrible, uh, level scaling for the monsters. Like, monsters always get a fuck ton of HP and they do a fuck ton of damage that's a terrible combo and like your own damage unless you go for like really really specific and crazy setups like you never scale one to one with the enemies and that applies to every single Bethesda game at least the ones that I have played and I have played uh all the <laughs> I have played all their fallouts and fall um, and all the their scrolls except the first one, the very first one. But I don't, I don't know if that one is from Bethesda. Huh? Oh my God, dude! Oh my God! When that Jagras move jump at me, I saw that. I saw. I did. I saw that first card coming. Oh, this is terrifying. <laughs> You know, I'm picking this antidote here, but I am realizing that it's useless. I'm never gonna use antidote, because if I get hit by an attack that poisons me, A, I'm gonna die from the hit, or B, if it doesn't, like, if the hit itself doesn't kill me, the first tick of the poison is gonna kill me, so... <laughs> Anyways... <laughs> Okay, let's move on to the first uh, urgent, or is it another tutorial? Because isn't now the 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 I think I forgot a setting because why is my map not opening like a shoe? I feel like my map is not opening properly. Oh, also uh, that that had to be like that. I forgot. Uh... Ah, here we go. Press. 
There we go. That's the setting that it need to be. Yeah, now, uh, exactly, yeah, backwards. Okay, there we go. Uh, woo, a lot of people to talk. Let's do the talk. Where is the people? Are the people? Ah, here we go. Oh, this guy. Oh my god, the great wire box. Oh, brother. I do not enjoy this, this little piece of the game at all. Worst news ever. Oh boy, yeah. Oh boy, yeah. A great decision, yummy, yummy. うんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうんうん
he's gonna be so hard because it's not the sushi itself he's obviously garbage easy like early game monster it's uh his bodies man this is the small sushi that's gonna be the problem oh let's see how these nightmares go Mm. Oh, that. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. I can't do that. That's literally like just opening to get killed by Aizushi. If I go for that, I'm dead. I'm somehow not dead. Oh my god. I didn't. I wasn't careful with my stamina. Okay, he's angry now. He's coming back up. How did he miss me? That is sushi. Almost killed me. Okay. Fuck me! Ah! Uh. Well, there is the first one. The first of many. Uh. <laughs> I should have played more uh, respectfully. Okay, round two. This time, let's uh, respect. Respect more. Uh, whoops, that's useless. Stamina. Please die. That's the combo that I died to. I guess not even. I need to kill these idiots. Did we finally kill one? Woo! Okay, there we go. 
My sharpness. Ah. Okay. I actually wasn't sure if I, I could counter. Because there are counters that uh, you can't use. Like there are counters that you can't use because you don't keep damage. Oh boy, that's cute. Yeah, uh, there are counters that you can't use in this game because you take like a little bit of cheap damage when you do them. And with 1 HP, I can't use them. For example, uh, the the Shoku Gietsu, however it's called, the Shoryuken on the Story yeah. Shield. I can't use that at one at one HP. I I will I will die through the counter. Oh boy! This challenge already started way better than I expected. Okay, this time, uh, like, I think I'm just playing too scared. I'm gonna try to be more proactive with my counters. I forgot to... Bro, why are you so slow? I'm gonna take this chance to kill the, the small ones. Ah, oh, come on, man. Don't call more. Wait, what? He didn't want to climb there? 
Okay, uh, here's a problem. I need to sharpen. Let's see if I can do this. Oh, uh, yes, the old reliable. The old reliable. No stamina, come on, baby, come by. We're alone, right? Yeah, we're alone. Perfect. Okay, doing good. Being patient is definitely paying off. Stop calling for help, you asshole. Making progress. Oh great, the push has arrived. Oh god, those two switches make this so much harder than it should be. Counter and it wasn't coming out. Why? I had the wire box. Oh my god, dude, fuck me, man. Like, come on, man, it's literally day one. Ain't no way I'm gonna struggle this hard against literally the first urgent quest. Ain't no way, dude.
狩らせてもらうよ。Sharp and real quick. Yeah. Oh, he missed me. Why do I keep going for the head? I should be going for the tail instead. Oh no, I'm dead. Wow, well, actually, is there not much any different from really? Two little eight heads are here. Okay, do they live with him or do they stay? They live, okay. Okay, so it's definitely worth it uh, killing the. Oh, never mind, they stay here. Ah, whatever. He went to another area. Mm. Oh my god, it's the Bulpango area. This is so over. This is so over. This is so over, man. What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? Oh. Also, that's the second time. I'm not sure if it's input lag because I'm doing that beautiful bad habit of mine of putting of mine of putting the controller under the table. I don't know if it's input lag because of that, but that's the second time, and I want to do a counter, and it doesn't come off. Mm. Nah. I'm gonna stick with the obelisk. <laughs> I 
I wonder if I should like change my focus and not like uh like don't hyper focus the the small ones. I'm not sure which one is is like worth it. Cause like I just don't like the idea of having uh, multiple monsters there. That's the, that's what I don't want want to happen. Wow, that was so close to being the fastest card. I'm gonna try something. I'm gonna kill one and let the other one alive. Because I'm not sure if he... Uh, if he's gonna like call back up on those conditions. Or if he's just gonna stay like this. I think one is dead, so no, it's a life damage. Okay, one is dead. Finally. And that right there is why I don't like having these guys around. Look up if I went for his tail right there, uh, I will have died to the to the small one. Oh now they are dead, whatever. So much for planning out. Your dad got you near automata for and switch? Oh man, that's that's nice. I love that game man. Near is so good. It's part of the reason why I'm super hyped with that new that new game that got announced, the uh Stellar Blade, the PS5 exclusive. I hope that game makes it to onto the PC eventually. Cause that game got endorsed by Joko Taro himself. Like he even went as far as to say that he liked it more than Nier Automata and I was like, holy shit. That's the mother of endorsement, cause man. The combat in the combat in Nier Automata is mm, mm, mm. That's just juicy. Oh, come on buddy. Stamina management is so annoying. I'm not used to this in this game. <laughs> I am so not used to like having to man actually having to manage my stamina in this game.
Yeah. Wow. This is really literally one hour of me fighting uh, great greatest switch, huh? Oh my god. Come on, buddy. <clears throat> it's just a fucking great sushi. It's not a heart. I miss Ryzen Sunbreak? I mean, I don't know. One can always, like, you know, try. What am I doing? One can always try, like, silly stuff to keep the game going. At least until uh, Wilds arrive. But, uh, like maybe that's a just me thing, cause I don't know about you guys, but I don't. I'm not usually like the type of person that goes uh, that go chasing whatever new game is out. Like you know, keep following what's new, what's new, what's new. Like I find that like tiring, and I also find like not not that many games are like of my interest. So I'm like always uh, replaying the same stuff over and over again. Like at most, what I tend to do is uh, is like a uh, play with challenges, like I'm doing today. Like come up with challenges to uh, uh, use as, a, as an excuse to revisit the game. Don't hit me! Dude, do duelists do really do this, this little damage? I think that he's sushi for so long, he's still alive. Okay, he's dead. Good. That almost looked like he I carded. Holy shit. I've been playing Final Fantasy 16 and waiting for Stella Blade. My man. I can only pray that game makes it to fuck me. Why why I why what I was reading chat? Anyways, uh I can only pray that game makes it to to PC eventually. Like a couple of months or a year later, like I hope it does. Like I trust uh Shift Ups Shift Up uh, knows what they are doing. I still want to play Final Fantasy 16, but I don't have any money yet. I feel you, bro. I've been there way too many times. Okay, um, let me try another weapon at this point, cause. But the question is, what do I even play? What do I even play? Because I feel like everything either is too slow and risky if I'm gonna be fighting like a monster that is surrounded by small monsters or they depend on counters that I can't use because uh, they are counters that do cheap damage and yeah, I already explained it. Uh, uh. You know what? Let me try sword and shield. Why not? Might as well. Oh, 
Holy Actually, I'm gonna play Sword and Shield, but uh, I need to practice a little bit the back hop at this turn. It's been a, it's been a while. Uh, let's see. Um. Oh my god. I think I made a mistake. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest. This will probably go worse than it's already going with the dual blitz. Like, uh, dude. I'm such a trap position. Because there is a weapon that obviously is the answer to the situation, but I am I'm just avoiding it because I know that people always dip out when I when I when I when I whip out the longsword, so yeah. I am basically have that weapon banned alongside the the ranged weapons. I can't wait to watch you play just to hear my brother in Christ. Ah <laughs> oh, dude. Right now like Right now, I just need to focus them. Just need to focus and find a way to like save something and upgrade my PC. To see if I can play like uh, more recent games. Cause, le cause lately, I've been missing some games. Le like lately, I've been missing some ga games. Not so much because of what I just said that I'm not interested, but because my PC is not strong enough. <laughs> I don't know what switch kills I have. Also, why this this is sushi? I'm dead. Why did he spawn here, dude? Why did he spawn here? Nah, fuck this. I'm sticking to I'm sticking to to the oblix. I I just gotta I just gotta I I, I just have to go in raw and figure out. Like a trading pattern, like I just have to figure out a trading pattern that is safer than the normal one. Yeah. Cause like I'm going at this guy like as usual, like with the same mindset as if it as if I wasn't playing at one HP, and that's what's what's getting me killed. That's what's getting me killed. I need to figure out a different uh, a different pattern. Different trait pattern. And I mean, it's also the fact that, as I mentioned before, uh, <laughs> I'm just getting used to right now to managing the stamina. I never had to do that before because ever since I started playing a uh, dual blitz, I always did it with the berserk skill, berserk strike combo. So, <sighs> God damn it, I keep wasting my rations. Okay, at least Great Sushi did me a solid one and, and didn't spawn on that uh, hell of an area. <laughs> oh, cause do you know a game that I will that I wanna that I, that I wanna play that I wanna catch up? Uh, the other Final Fantasy that also came close to 16, uh, what's the name? A Strangers of Paradise. The insert uh, chaos meme. I wanna play that one. Cause that game looks like so much fucking fun. To be had. Motherfuckers. I'm gonna go crazy on this class already! 
I'm about to go insane already. Lagging on my side, Persia, go shout out for your storms. Oh man, really? Uh, that's mildly annoying. What was that? How did he reposition like that? I don't even want to talk about that cart. Holy moly. At this point, at this point, at this point, this great sushi is literally a speed running me. At this point, this went from me hunting great sushi to how fast great sushi can cart, can cart me. Uh. <laughs> Holy shit, dude. I'm starting to think that, that even if I broke uh, the rule that I just mentioned and I whip out the longsword, I feel like it's not gonna be enough. Something tells me that, that even if I bring out the longsword, I, I'm just gonna like counter something and a small monster is gonna nimble me the second I, I'm like locked out in the counter animation a small monster is gonna nimble me I feel that's exactly what's gonna happen Okay, the small ones are there. He's gonna do something after that or not? Okay. Of course. <laughs> hmm. Let's play safe. Here they're coming. Thank God there was a lower altitude there. Pretty sure he was gonna get me there.
要注意だ今のうちだねこのままわおコモン Why is the counter? OK, wait, wait, OK I need to go, I need to check something Cause this is already like the fourth part, I think Under the same interaction, like the same exact word I need to check, I need to see if I am in the run or is something else in the room, like Fuck me, man It's just a great sushi, I am not wasting the entire first stream of this challenge on his trash ass like I just not Oh my god, so many cuts! It's on my back! Oh. Whoa! Okay. Almost dropped my water bottle. Thank god it's one of those, uh, this time to not spill. <laughs> oh, brother. Nothing can go my way. Not in game, not in real life. Feels great, man. Okay, let me do a little bit of uh, frame data before I continue because I feel like I am overestimating when I can counter. I am. I I am. Wow. Yes, it's me in the run. It's me in the run. I have been severely underestimating like when I can go for a for a counter after this move. That's why I keep getting hit. Oh my god. Okay, then... If I can't counter there, then... That's not what I'm trying to do. Whoops. That's not what I want to do. No, that's not what I'm trying to do. Okay, I... I got it. Now I know that... That, that what I, that I've been trying to do there, that, that doesn't work. Okay. Now I'm clear about that. With the knowledge that I am garbage at this game, let's move forward. Okay, it's sushi is not in the terrible place again. Nice, nice, that's good, that's good. Bro, you never get hit like this, it's only because of the challenge. I am... I am inclined to believe that I am making certain choices that are... that are coming, you know, from the fact that I am, like... I permanently have in my mind the fact that I'm playing with one HP and one card, like there is no room for mistakes. I literally have to play perfectly every hunt through this challenge. Like yeah, that admittedly is uh, you know making me make mistakes, but come on dude, it's great in sushi. He's not like that. He's not like that. This is not the monster to get stuck in, dude. Dude, 
Dude, I really like when he starts in the other area where I can use the flash bomb to get rid of the small ones first. I really like that star, man. Wish I could get it consistently. But looks like uh, this is the area that has the default... The default um, spawn, like the higher chance. Did you saw that? I knew it wasn't crazy. These switches are canceling animations. They will be like in the middle of one animation and they go for another. I knew it wasn't crazy and they are doing that. Because before, when I carted, uh, when he did the tail slam and, uh, and, I, and, the, and I got jumped by the switches, it was because I saw them already on an animation and then they cancel and went for a jump. Okay, so, I see. Canceling and teleporting. Oh, brother. <laughs> okay, one, one is switched down. Now we go for the other one. You hear that? He is, let's fucking go. Okay. Okay, let's do this. And he made a legend just area. What an asshole. Okay, come on. Come on, buddy. Come on, come on, come on, come on. That did way less damage than I expected. I need to grab the wire For my pets, because he aimed that way up. Oh, brother, the stamina management is so annoying. Like, I feel like my stamina recovers so much slower than that I consume it. Like, way slower. Oh, great. This asshole are here again. An opportunity to strike, an opportunity to kill this Isushi is more like... Go, go, go. 
が熱く燃えている<笑>この技が見切れるかな Oh my god. Oh, progress. We got a ride. Don't give me this stupid tutorial. I know how to ride a monster. Perfect. Oh no. I can't believe I'm excited about <laughs> killing a great sushi. <laughs> oh, God. Guys, I'm gonna make a confession right now. I am not excited at all about the rest of the Raptors. Like, if this was with a great sushi, I already don't want to fuck with uh, with the bushi. Oh god. <laughs> <clears throat> Holy shit. Wow. Almost two hours is stuck on a greedy sushi. That's wild, man. Oh, a lot of people want to talk. Yay. Whew. Or Axel? No, son? Oh god. Oh my god. I already have so many troubles like uh, oh. consistently dodging yeah. Agnoson of Fireballs because the way they bounce. Oh brother. Agnoson, oh god. You're, okay, you know something hilarious? I feel like this challenge is gonna go backwards. Like, I feel like I'm gonna struggle so hard. Like right here at the start of the challenge. And when I get like someone around like Master Rank 4 or 5, because around that, uh, like around that difficulty is where I'm starting to get like really familiar with the monsters. I feel like that's when the difficulty, like between that and having access to, you know, some skills, I feel like that's where the challenge is gonna be easier. But right now, the start between having no skills at all and between me not being familiar with most of these monsters. Because let's be real, early against monsters, you kill them at the start of the game, and then you never see them again. <laughs> like, that's how it is. So they're the monsters that the least, the least experience I have. <sighs> like, yeah, I, I, didn't, I didn't actually think about it like that. Most of the... Walls on this run will definitely be the early game monsters. Like, you know another monster that's gonna fuck me up? And it's because of that, that, uh... That I, that I don't fight them enough. Like, I don't fight fa fight them enough to know them. Uh, Tetranadon. Tetranadon, Tetranadon, I remember, gave me so much trouble. When I played this game for the first time, because... All of these animations always feels so slow and delayed like all his attacks feel so slow ah so many people want to talk to me finally uh what ah okay Okay, what's new? We have our Suros gathering baggies, the devil, I mean, great baggy, and hated fighting the them during the investigations. 
I mean, I mean, personally, I enjoyed, like, I enjoyed, the, I enjoyed the aspect of fighting early game monsters, but with end game stats. I low key enjoy that, but it doesn't change the fact that yeah, I, I just don't like the this the, the early game monsters. Or not that I don't like them, it's that I am I don't have enough practice to enjoy those fights, and there is like no real reason to like waste your time learning it, no? Unless you're trying to like speedrunning or something. Okay, we gotta do three, huh? I hate this lighting, bunny. I actually like Lagombi. I want to fight Arsuro so bad, but Arsuro is such a terrible matchup for Duo Blitz. Especially at this point in the game. Wow, I love I love how everything on this uh, bracket is weak to fire, but I don't have access to a fire weapon. That that's that's just cute. That's just cute. Oh, whatever. Let's let's keep going. Let's see how how deep this this hellhole goes. Uh, does this unlock something? No, it doesn't. It doesn't unlock anything. So no, nah. I'm not gonna go for that. For that. You know what? Fuck it. Let's suffer. Let's go for great. Let's go directly for great baggy. Like, might as well get the suffering out of the way. Might as well make suffering the main thing of today's stream. Oh my brother in Christ. You know what's gonna make or what who make uh you know what could make uh this fight ten times worse? If the sleep attack of the baggies and the great baggy if the sleep attack doesn't insta kill me and it actually makes me like uh walk drowsy and sleep like if it actually does that holy moly this great baggy will probably live rent free on my mind for the rest of the week look at this asshole Look at this asshole. Thinking he's tough because he has chloroform. Okay, let's do this. <laughs> I'm gonna take that, but something tells me I will never get to use that. <laughs> now that I think about it, I wonder what Wild's monster intro gonna look like. I hope that they either come with a they like they come up with a new format. Or they just do them like they did in Word. Where they are like cinematic, like cinematic and interactive, con like sorry, cinematic cutscenes. That involve your character. I just hope they do them like that, because I think that's definitely the best format to 
to introduce the monsters. Like the intros here in 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 Rise and my station summer, right? Like the intros here. I like them because they aesthetically fit the game. But it's just that they fit the game. They definitely don't feel like a format that I wanna see over and over again. Like at all. Did we kill one? Oh, we killed one already. Let's go. Let's go for the second one. Is it dead already? Oh, baby. Let's go. If you... This might not be so bad. He says before he instantly cards. Game through this fight. Thank you very much. Yeah, yes, spam that. Spam that shit. Oh my god, I almost jumped into him. I did it again! I fully rush when he was already on an on a like doing an attack animation. Oh. God damn it. Well I'm all I'm going to say is that I hope that they are created on like the generations intros. I mean the generations intro like they get a pass because yes they are lazy but it's because you have to remember that generations is a celebration of like 10 years of monster hunter 15 i think it was but no i think no it was 10 years the point is is that, that generations is a celebration of all the previous games so it's not meant to be a whole new like main game and whatever it's literally just supposed to be what it is a mash of all the other games so Considering the generations had to bring back literally or basically every previous monster, they got a pass for just, you know, giving them the bare minimum with the intros. I didn't know the most. I create all new monsters, please? I don't know if we are ready. Like, I don't know if we are ready for, for the Monster Hunter team. To pull a uh, uh, black and white with Monster Hunter, as in make a game that the entire cast is like new monsters, like like little to known uh, old school monsters. I don't know if that will like if that will be that good for for Monster Hunter. Like I feel that yeah, you can definitely you know move the pendulum a little like. Make it to a ratio where it is like 70% new monsters and only 30% old monsters. But I feel like regardless of which way you go, you need to go like that. Like, there has to be some old school representation. No, 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 no,
<laughs> Thank God I didn't finish that word. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> oh, yeah. dude! Oh my god, man! And that's like the perfect area for him to spawn. Because he spawns, he spawns alone. And there are no other aggro monsters, because the Amtega like, leave immediately. Holy moly, man. Oh, that was the quest, man! And don't get me started with the weapons in war, because... Nah, bro. I... I need to believe, at this point, like at this point, right, with Monster Hunter, and with the uh, Back to World and all that, I need to believe that the developers are more than clear that they fucked up with the slap on designs. I need to believe that they know that they fucked up and they are never doing that again. I don't care how much you want to do this because aesthetics or whatever other excuse, nah bro, that's just lazy. That's just lazy, man. I like how I'm wasting my time grabbing these spirit flies. Like, like I'm not gonna get one shot immediately when I get to the to the great bag. One thing for sure, let them cook, indeed. The Monster Hunter thing has never disappointed, disappointed us yet, and hey, until they do, I will blindly believe in them. Until the moment they give me a reason to, like, don't trust them. Wow, that dog didn't even roar. He went a straight for a, for a projectile. What an asshole. Dude, I don't like this area. There are way too many small monsters. Remobras, the baggies. Oh, the poison. Oh, the poison. I don't like this area, dude. Can we please leave? The baggies are dead, I think. That's great. Now is this Remobras the problem? This is so stressful! That's why I'm scared of the Remobra. That attack right there. I feel like I'm gonna focus on this dude! And the moment I do so, one of them is gonna jump in with that. Did they left? Oh, baby, let's go. Okay, now I can focus on this guy. Why so greedy? Why was I born so greedy? God damn it! God damn it! Yeah. 
Let's keep going. Oh my god. A spawn on the worst fucking place. That stupid ass uh, underground cave. Wow. That has to be like the worst. Out of those three spawns that he already showed, that one has to be the worst. Dude, it's no wonder that uh, it's no wonder that speed running in this game, like people always use uh, that one mod that makes it so um, that one mod that makes it so uh, you get you can choose which of the three spawns that the monster has, uh, like you can control which one they spawn in in the quest. No wonder people use that thing, cause Jesus, why is it always that the best place? Is the one with the least rate and vice versa. Like the worst place is the one that happens the most. Like why is it why did they make that consistent dude? Like come on man. Like look at this nightmare. Look at this nightmare of an area. No, you know what? I actually refuse to fight here. I won't even try. I refuse to fight this guy here. Like, are you crazy? Maybe this area is better, but I don't think so. No, no. There are also. There are Santrios here. Those are Santos, right? Yeah, there are Santos here. Keep going, dude. Keep going. Keep going. We're moving until the, the place is good. It's good to go. Which would probably be this one. Oh, uh, never mind. Oh, wow, we went full circle. I was expecting him to go out uh, there. Bro, why does that attack do no damage in this game? This quest! How am I supposed to approach this asshole? Between the removers and the sm and the baggies. God damn it, man! Baggy down. Yeah. <laughs> of course, he magically didn't hit me.
Oh man, the stamina is used. That's what I wanted. I was wondering if this guy didn't have topples like uh, the other. I can see. Mm. Okay. He has a jump. Ah. I need to sharpen. Let me sharpen and recover stamina. Get out of the way. I don't like that bite combo. Does it, it doesn't look like consistent. It doesn't look consistent at all. Okay, making progress. Making progress. Taking it easy. Maybe this is the one. Or maybe I'm gonna cart immediately. Oh my god, the remote was great. Oh wow, why did we move to this area, bro? This is so full of remote rust, it's not even funny. with your tire animation, you motherfucker. Sushi, take that shit away from my screen, I can see! Did it ever turn off the tutorials? Wow, so much for doing that. Is the buggy dead? 
Go. Oh, yeah, he's dead. Nice. Oh. Yes! Give me that beautiful slow motion. Oh! Okay. Yeah. Yeah. This... This is definitely... This is definitely a case of... Uh, I just have to adapt. Like... I just have to drill in my small ass brain. You have one HP. You have one card. You gotta play it safe. You can't go combo monsters like usual. Just gotta do that. <laughs> I gotta... I gotta repress those uh, Onga Bonga imp impulses. I gotta repress those and just take it easy. Take it easy. Whew. Diversion scroll. Ooh. Hmm. Considering the nature of the nature of the cha of the challenge, uh, that might be a good idea. I'm gonna give it a try and see and see what it does. Okay, that's one key down, two to go. Okay, good. Let's see. Lagombi. Well, I mean, if I ignore the other two, then these are like the only Kikos that I can do, so sure. Let's go for Arsuros. That, as I am said, mm, this one is gonna be super annoying. Not because of him, uh, but because of the damage. Like. Because our Arsuros are best quick spots are the front paws in the head. This is gonna take a million hits. A million hits. I uh, will just power through it, I guess. <laughs> okay, our service let's see. I keep growing potions like I feel like I'm ever gonna use them. Dore, dore. Mm, 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 mm. 
Man, every time I listen to Jet Set Radio soundtrack, I just wanna watch. I just wanna play the game. Soundtrack's too strong, man. One, two, three. I underestimated the range of that attack so hard. He didn't. He, I didn't card that just out of pure luck. Dude, I'm taking this like box that like, gave the stamina down buff, but I barely feel the effects of this. I swear I was dead. I swear that was that was going to do damage and kill me. Holy moly. I wanna believe this these guys are not gonna come and help him, right? Oh, never mind. Is the Apex or Suros the one that is not weak on the on his ass? The normal one is. Oh, that's good. That's good for me. Oh, yep. Ah, I put that thing in a bad place. Couldn't capitalize my damage. He's retiring, let's go. Wow, is this gonna be it? The first monster that I will be able to kill without carting? Oh my, oh my, oh my god! I'm just in this quest so hard. Watch, watch Arsuros kill me the moment we reach this area. Oh, 
加減はできないよ<笑>スタミナに注意だ Almost got me. Capture? We are not gonna capture him. I don't have the items to do that. Oh god. Imagine getting stressed out by a, by a stupid Arsurus. Couldn't be me. Couldn't be me. <laughs> hey, what's up, Danny? Random question Is it me or in word is harder to land? The Hayaya Spirit Slash after... Even after Quick Shoot 3? Uh, it's not due. It's like that. Cause, uh... The... The animation for the cheating, cheating with Longsword In Rise, it's way shorter. Like, in general, it's way shorter compared to Ward. Especially the level 3, like the level 3 quick shit for Longsword in Rise compared to uh, to Ward and all the previous games, it's night and day, dude. Where is this Arsuros going? Because, like, the thing is, is that uh, you can't play, uh, you can't play uh, Ward's Longsword with the mentality of Rise Longsword, Rise Longsword, where where you're gonna like, uh, you know... Where you're gonna like, uh... Spam counters back to back. You, or like, spam a lot of counters. You can't do that. You can't do that in Word. In Word, you you have to go through the... With the mentality of... You are gonna counter, right? A high eye slash. And either... You are gonna let your character shit, right? Like, shit the sword. And then you, from there... You re-engage with the monster. Or you go for a Helmbreaker. So you have to see the counters in Ward more like a... More like a resource instead of... Instead of like a, your main damage as it is in Sunbreak. Holy moly! It happened! I killed something without carting! I killed something without carting! Oi, Sabebe! Woo! Okay, sorry for that. I don't know why I'm getting excited about beating Nanarsuros, but hey. This challenge is just doing weird stuff to my brain. Let's move on. Next up is Lagombi. 
Let's see if Lagombi is equally as easy. You know something? I just realized I've been skipping the the Yomogi animation. I haven't seen the Yomogi animation with the meat. With the meat mod that I have. Let's see that one. Wow, okay. I don't know if it was intentional from the author of this mod, but I love the detail that when she puts the, you know, the, the like the last, the last couple of things on the dango, like quote unquote on the dango. I like that it actually fits the mid, <laughs> like it, it doesn't stay uh, like floating or something. That's actually cool. Actually, let me leave the music pause because we're gonna see uh, Lagombi's intro now. Oh boy, time to suffer. Now you point it out. Is it always like that prior to rise? I mean, why make high slash if it's not reliable enough? Well, the thing is, Danny, is that the the counter longsword was born in Ward. Like pr prior to Monster Hunter Ward, longsword was n neither didn't have a counter nor was his gameplay center around that. Like. Longsword was always like a simple weapon where the attractive was that it was simple and that it have a self buff and in old school monster hunter uh, weapons like longsword and insect glib are valuable because of that because they have like a self buff like they have a free attack of large built in the, in the weapon mechanics which means that you can that you can pursue other skills with your armor and you can forget about the raw attack skills because the weapon already has them that was the attractive of Longsword. Ward was the one that introduced the high eye, the high eye, the high eye counter and the spirit slash. Like Ward was the one to introduce those, but they introduced them. Like I told you, they introduced them more as a defensive mechanic, not so much as the main focus on the weapon. Rice was the one that made the change and made it so that instead of whatever Longsword was doing at the time, Rice just said, like, "Fuck it, we counter now." Actually, no, let me correct that. It wasn't Rice, actually, that did that. Like, Rice pushed in that direction, but it was Sunbird, actually, that, cement, that cemented a Longsword as a counter weapon. Like, you're literally losing DPS with Longsword when you're not countering, and that's just crazy to me. But it is what it is. Now that I think about it, who is the... Who is the urgent quest of the tour star rank? トロエトルオウソンウエオジュウソンニコクマコインドソムエトイゾウユキニチオヌラセツノリ。Why so adorable? Oh, okay. Let's do this. Kien Banjo. Oh, he's right here. Nice. Wing. Okay, that bunny bot is not as uh he's not like a uh, what's his name? The Arsuros one, but uh 
We can work it out. Okay, at least you also have that move. Or you still have it more like it. I feel like if I die to him, it's gonna be because of the slide. Like, he's gonna slide into me, and I'm not gonna be ready. I feel that's what's gonna kill me on this fight. Uh, where are you going, dude? Oh, he's going for the cat. Need to avoid the ledge just like the plague. Oh, I couldn't get the tail. Ah, couldn't get the face. Whoa, what are you doing, my guy? Oh my god, bro, don't improvise your combos like that. You're gonna give me heart attack. Okay, he's wilding. This is so tense. I've been wondering, isn't Rise Sunbreak with full spirit beers equal to health boost from the Fatalis Amos, uh, armor bonus? Yeah. It's technically that. Oh my god. I need to get out of here. I need to get out of here. This cave is a hazard. The Lagombi just tripped and I wasted it. God damn it. Please tell me they are dead. Okay, great. He goes for that attack, it's giving me a heart attack, dead ass. Because I don't think I can actually react to that. I don't think I can react.
Do stop hugging the wall! There's the stop hugging the wall, dude. Oh my god! <laughs> I'm stressing, man! Okay, come on. I feel like I'm like I'm I'm close. We are close. A mistake that thankfully I wasn't punished for. Oh. That's the attack that I want to keep baiting. That's such a good opening. Such an unnecessary risk. Yes. Where are you? I mean, I don't... Oh, the Palico. Give me the opening, man. Only going for safe openings. Yeah, baby. Oh, we got this. We got this by the ass. Oh, I just unlocked Guiding Lands on Iceborne. Do you have any tips for starting Guiding Lands? Which to focus, maybe? Yes. Yes. You want to try... Not necessarily, like, rush it, right? But with your Guiding Lands levels... Guiding... Ugh, guiding Lands levels... You want to make sure... The Coral... The Coral Highlands... And the... Um... Um... Uh, give me a second, um... And the Tundra one, the Ice one, you want the Coral and the Ice ones. You want those really high level. Because um, most materials that you want for your augments come from monsters from there. So you want those like, uh, I, always keep an, I always keep an eye on those. Uh, 
after that, uh, your tier, your like the third one, the third one that you want to keep a high level. That's not what I want to do. <laughs> the third one that you want to keep high level, just uh, optional, you know. Like that one, you choose it in the moment. But the coral and the ice, you want those two as up and uh, like as as up as you can, as high level as you can. Wow. Oh! Right in the Lagusi. Damn. <laughs> Damn. That kill came just for the run. <laughs> Whoa! Woo! Dude, monsters back to back with the tarting. Let's go. Let's fucking go. <laughs> I think the monsters in world were very unique. Oh, for augments, I still don't understand the custom augment option. Like the extra augment option that some weapons have. That one is actually super straightforward. Like, there is no secret uh, build for those, Danny. They are straightforward. You always go. Uh, you always go raw. Sorry, you always go raw. If it's a raw weapon, an elemental. If it's an elemental weapon, and there is one step. Like when you're upgrading like that. There is one step that doesn't let you grab either attack or elemental attack. I don't remember what you take on that step. Like I actually forgot. But I know that for the most part you just blind you just blindly go raw attack or elemental, depending on, on the on the weapon. You don't you don't go like nitpicking or doing something really very like very specific. Oh man. いつでも遊びに来てね。お友の子とならまかせて。遊びに来てくれている。お友達じゃ。また。絶好の狩猟日和。おお、アクノソーメンスで。おお、マイガード。では、ご覧ください。おお、アクノソーメンスで。おお、
Yeah, you usually like have to invest in crit for the fatalist weapons, but outside of the fatalist weapons, you just do that. Either full of the dam of the damage in stat, raw element, or a single uh, health augment, healing augment, sorry, and then a full raw element. A slot upgrade is good? Nope. A slot upgrade upgrades are hundred percent useless. They have a single a single use in the entire game, and it's Nietzsche. Like it doesn't have to do with combat. Like the only use that uh, slot upgrades have in that game is when you make a uh, what's the word that I'm looking for? When you make a gathering set, a gathering set like for the guiding lands. There is a there is a an event doably that you can grab and you can uh, slot augment it so that it has three level four slots that's literally the only use that a slot upgrades have there is not a single weapon in that game that benefits from sacrificing either healing or extra attack or elemental to get like that extra slot not a single Dude, I need to unlock the camps. I've been skipping that. I'm gonna do that at the end of the stream. At the end of the stream, I'm gonna take a couple of minutes to unlock camps and stuff. Okay, let's see how terrible this is gonna be. Like, we're already in a bad place, so... Dude, stop it, seriously. So unsure when it's a good opening and when it is, it is not. I'm also scared of the range of, of his wings. So bad. Oh God! Kill this guy. Kill him. Okay, at least I got one before the Akinosan came. Yes, kill the other one. Let's go. No, you mother! I love this game. No, sorry. I love this challenge. I love this challenge so much.
It's, it's kind of bummer. I cannot slot some airborne deco in my build right now. Uh, Danny, I'm gonna give you a sad truth. If you're talking about the slotting in uh, airborne, airborne to boost your insect leva damage in the air, that doesn't work. For some stupid reason, airborne doesn't boost the damage or your attacks in the air. It boosts the attack of your, like it boosts the attack of your uh, attacks that, of your jump attacks. But by jump attacks, it doesn't mean when you're in the air. It means like when you lo when you jump, for example, from a ledge and you attack. Like that single attack is the one that is boosted. And for insect leap, it only boosts like the very first, like whatever you do after you jump, the first hit is boosted, and the rest are not. I don't know why they make the ar airborne deco like that, but it is what it is. So I will actually recommend to you that you stop uh, that you stop using that decoration. It's literally a waste of a space. Um. Yeah, I mean, like, I don't know. I, I don't know why, I don't know why, it, like, it's worth it, like it is in-game. But it works like how I tell you right now. I don't know why it, it does it, but, uh, it is what it is, I guess. But, yeah, like, because, like, on paper, the airborne deco reads like that. Like, it's just a boost to your aerial moves in the insect leg. But, in reality, it just does what I told you. Total scam of a decoration. Cause like, and you know what's the like the more depressing part, Danny? The only skill, right, that actually helps. Oh, I forgot the the rations. Uh, the only skill that actually boosts the damage, like all of your aerial damage with the insect leg, is the armor set bonus from the from the behemoth armor. Cause the behemoth armor has two skills. One is master touch. And the other is, uh, the other, I don't remember if it's called Dragon Soul or something like that, but it's a unique, uh, a skill from the, from the armor set, armor set when you have, like, I think it's when you have all five pieces or at least four pieces, and it's a skill that, that one actually boosts by 30% all your aerial damage for the insect leg. But that's the only skill that does that, and unfortunately, that skill is not available in my, in, my, in master rank. Sadly, like there is no equivalent to that because the decoration doesn't work like that, and there's no other equivalent. I feel scammed. I, I know that feeling, that feel, bro. I know that feel all too well. I too was like that when I when I learned about that. I was like, you have to be kidding me, dude. That motherfucker almost got me there. Yeah. 
Is he angry? Oh, that's an answer. Oh, he's gonna leave the area? What? That's stressful. <laughs> okay, he went to that place. I am not playing games. I am dog bombing his face and we're going to another area that is less hellish. I already learned my lesson. I think there are also small monsters in that area, but whatever. It has to be better than the other one. My build right now is Nargakuga 3 for the Razor Sharp and Barion and Legs for Eva Extender. That, that's solid. I, I, I myself, I have used that for progression. Yeah, that's a solid one. Wacky clap those cheeks. Huge. Oh, I thought it was gonna roar. Since he's saying green out. Oh no, he's tired. Okay, honestly, I thought Agnoson Agno was gonna be harder to deal with, but uh. He's alright. Can you get away from the ledge, please? And the answer is no. Okay, that's not fair, man. Don't hug the, the wall like that. There we go. See, that's better. Oops. Oh great, these assholes are now involved in the fight. Just what I don't want, don't want to happen. Ah, I should have done that when he was in the air. I'm an idiot. Actually, I need to sharpen. Well, 
followers. Is it true that resuscitate equal to max kill when prone? Uh, what? Danny, I think you're gonna have to uh, make that question again. I kinda don't get it. Do resuscitate equal to max kill when prone? Oh my god, this place. I don't wanna fight this guy here. No, 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 please, let's not fuck it up now. We are doing so great. Where he was like the hitbox was gonna be active and I was gonna die there. I'm taking so many unnecessary risks. Do it again. Never mind. This is taking so long. Damn. Resuscitate gives uh, evade window and stamina reduction when procs and ward. Ah, uh, yeah. Um, I don't remember at the top of my head, like the amount that it gives, but I, I believe, like I'm not sure, but I believe that it's equal to uh, no, actually, yeah, I think it gives max. I think it gives max, actually. But um, I'm actually not sure, because, uh, to be honest, I never bothered with that skill myself, so... I am not 100% sure. Come on, Agnes, I'm starting to put an end to this. Oh my god, I used my counter there, bro. Don't hit me with that bullshit.
Oh, I was so focused on the wire, but I almost got hit there. is actually destroying this guy he has got like he has gotten so many part breaks it's actually crazy As I was saying. Oh my god! <laughs> Jesus Christ, Subaki, Yama it all! Damn! This boy is getting destroyed! Okay. Okay. We are almost there. Almost there. Let's not fumble. Uh, uh, I should have come in sooner and get rid of these uh, guys. Yes, we are fighting. Kinda? One, two, three. That chicken, well, that chicken no more. Oh, wow, amazing. And you know the crazy part? This would have been a three hunts with no cards in a row if it wasn't for that stupid Binab Banabra man, or however it's pronounced that Binabra Banabra, I don't know, but uh, if it wasn't for that asshole getting me the first attempt, man. Holy moly, I'm telling you man, the small monsters are, the, are gonna be my biggest ups through this entire challenge. They are gonna be like my biggest enemy dude. Oh, 60 minutes, damn. But at least I, I did it. Alright. <laughs> Uh, funny enough, uh, Akinasan offers us our first uh, fire duo blades. But I am pretty sure that every single elemental duo blade in base rice is not worth it. Oh, Fetalaces, nice. Those things are useless to me. Oh. Oh, oh, 
Hmm, what level of constitution or what level of... Nah, hunger resistance. That's not even a question. Okay, the one that gives the more stamina. This one. There. Okay, let's check out uh, Agnason's Dual Blitz. Oh, wow, I unlocked way more than just his Dual Blitz. Wow, that's a lot of options. Uh, let's see. Yeah, there, there they are. Hunter attack, a little bit of green. Empire. I mean, at least I can, like, grab it right now. If I get the Macalite over, but. Eh. Uh, okay, gonna do a quick uh, expedition. Oh, 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 oh no, oh no. Shit. Okay, no, uh, no, yeah, you know what, yeah, I'm gonna do a quick expedition to, to grab what I'm missing to get this upgrade and I'm gonna keep going. I should probably upgrade my armor <laughs> now that I think about it. Like I've been ignoring my ar my armor because the defense don't matter, but the skills do. Like maybe I can. I'm right now like for the duration of the base game, I'm looking for evade window, wyvern whisper. An evade extender. Basically evasion and the, and the wirebox skills. I'm not looking for damage. I don't need damage. I need survivability. Let's see. Uh, Constitution will be nice too, now that I think about it. So that I can manage uh, even less stamina. Let's see. Uh, what's the piece that gives uh, Constitution? The arms. Gonna keep it in my hand. Another level of constitution. Okay. I got arms and a waist with constitution. Let's see. Uh, okay. Uh, do they overlap? Do they overlap with no? Okay, I have Warble Whisper in the chest here. Okay, sure, let me do it. Uh. Let's equip this. And then this. There we go. Oh! I have, and that I have three points of constitution. That's cool. Uh, my drip is ruined, though. There we go. <laughs> that fixes it. Um, let's pick with all the NPCs. Okay, um, I'm gonna take a quick uh, detour, like I said, upgrade the dual blades, and let's see if we can keep pushing. So that either I'll li I'll leave it, like I'm, I think I'm gonna stop at either at the urgent for four four stars, like either before or after. We'll see. <laughs> Depends how much I'm gonna suffer through the uh, three star rank. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, we finally get this. That's cool, except that I already have everything I want here. At least un until we get the scroll change on in summary. I am not using Demon Flight ever. Like, if I pick Demon Flight on the challenge, it's gonna be me jumping in the air to evade something and then getting killed the moment I land. Like, I, I already know. Oh my god, so many NPCs. Oh, you want Macalite ore? Uh, sorry, buddy. I need those for myself. Okay, let's take a sneak peek. Oh, fuck, bro. The Tranadon. Oh, Kuloyaku, yes! We can finish the stream with a uh, Luna Strip. Nice. Fighting dirty. I need to do four. Wow, okay. Uh, I think I'm gonna do everyone but Barrot. This is gonna be terrible, by the way. <laughs> Anywho. Anywho, let's do an expedition. Hide on Iceborne, how do you show combo damage on training ground? I can simplify the option. It should be there by default. Um, oh, like, uh, I think, not 100% sure, but I believe that if you're not getting the damage numbers on the dummy in Iceborne, it's because you disabled... Uh, you disable the option in the menu that it, that talks about uh, like giving you tips or tool tips for your weapon. Like there's an option somewhere around in the menu that talks about that. If you disable that, it disables the damage against the dummy. I don't know why. Uh. Ooh. Upsurge of mining outcrops. Wow. What an excellent timing. <laughs> what an excellent timing. Do this expedition uh, real quick. And then uh yeah. Let's see if I can deal with the uh, with the with those four bad boys before I finish the stream today. For today. Uh, which by the way guys uh, for those of you who are watching and are interested in um you know keeping up with my suffering through this challenge um i'm gonna be streaming say same hour from wednesdays through saturdays like each day i'm gonna be i'm gonna be going with this challenge so yeah just so you guys know if you're interested um i'm keep watching I'm keeping up, sorry. <laughs> oh boy, yeah. Come on, Makalai. Fuck. Dude, it's been so long. Thanks for the schedule, brother. No problem, man. No problem, my brother. Uh, dude, it's been so long since I have to gather materials manually. I deadass don't know where is anything in this game right now. 
もらっていく I think there are a couple nuts up there, no? If there isn't this one or the other, there are like a, a couple. Come on, Daddy wants this new. Fuck, is the other one. Daddy wants this screen sharpness. Wow, I am not getting my collide over today, huh? Check on maps. Oh, what that reminded me. Wait. Since I'm doing this, might as well. Does that mean I'm like doing this uh, investigation? Or sorry, gathering quest? Ooh. Might as well. Also, thanks for reminding me, Danny. Uh, where am I? Okay. Wait, what is it? There is one around here, but where? Oh, ah, uh, damn it. Oh, I, I know, I now I know, I know, I know, I know what which one is talking about. And I'm going in the wrong direction. Man, I'm so good at following a map, huh? Wait, what? Up there? Wasn't down here? What? Where the fuck is that mining node? Oh, there is. Jesus. Bro, what? Come on, buddy. Where is the mac alive? I know it's a rare, it's always a rare drop in low rank, but Jesus, I don't need that many. Please, I just want three. I just want three. Please. That's exactly what I was trying to avoid. Hmm. Whatever, let me finish this route. I'm gonna go around here and then inside the cave and if they are not if if I don't get more doing this damn then that stuff. Uh what? I distinctly remember Mining nodes around here. Are they not here because it's low rank? Wow, that sucks. You have to be kidding me. Yeah, they are, they are definitely missing because it's low rank. I hope the ones in the cave are there. Because if I take that route and I don't see them, then wow. That's tough. Okay. This one is here. There should be more down there. No Macalite at all. Mm 
Yes! And exactly three! Yeah, baby! That's what we've been waiting for! Woo! Let's do a one round up. Oh, yes! Yummy! Okay, that's enough, yeah. That's that's my upgrade right there. Let's keep going. Nice. <laughs> 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 anyway, I'm gonna start uh, straight up with Kulu Yaku. This stream doesn't end without Luna having her iconic ears and tail. Oh god. Yeah. No, fuck you. I'm not giving you my mac at all. Slay A, Roy. Whoa, 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 you see? Ah, fuck, I forgot that. Neopteron materials. Neopteron. Neopteron. Ah. Uh, are those the bugs? That's bugs, right? Like, I'm pretty sure that's what it is, right? Yes, it's bugs. Uh, fuck. Okay, I'm gonna need to do another one. Uh, where do I get box? Like, where? Where do I get like the small box? The one that gather. Uh, where do I get those consistent? Uh, where do you see those consistently? Gonna go to the ruins boat uh, to unlock the, the camp. To unlock the camp. And also uh, for the box, because I think I know where they are here on this map. <laughs> Can't find the option? Really, man? Oh boy. Um, like man, that, that's the only reason that occurs to me why you wouldn't find the sorry, why you wouldn't see the damage against the dome in Iceborne. Because I remember that uh, I was turning off stuff on my game to to do like a hotless thing, like I was doing in Sunbreak, and I remember that that happened to me. Like I turned off the weapons token or something like that, and then boom, suddenly uh, I get no, I can't see the the damage lock against the dome. So I believe that's what happened to you, but uh, I just don't remember what is. No, the run. <laughs> Fuck. Uh. Okay, I didn't know those bugs could escape like that. Uh. What do I do now? I guess I can uh, unlock the camp and come back and see if they're if they're out. Hopefully. Oh boy, it's been a while. There we go. 
Now let's go back and see if the bugs are there. Oh, there they are. Hopefully, this is enough. Motherfucker. <laughs> uh, you could see, you could see it in his eyes. He was so ready for that. Yes, <laughs> yes. Don't matter, I grab my stuff. Dead by mosquito. And ironically not the first one on the on the on this challenge. And I have a big feeling that it's not gonna be the last one. It is sushi. Easy. There we go. There we go. A little bit of sharpness. Let's go and fight our boy Kuluyaku finally. We can we can go back to progression. Wow, Kuluyaku? Uh, because of the of the egg will probably be annoying. <laughs> he will probably be a little bit annoying because of the egg and stuff, but we'll see. Oh no, the Dilex, oh god. I pray Kluyaku doesn't go through those zones. Holy moly. <laughs> Dead by swordfish, dude. Those little assholes have ruined so many speedruns of mine that I know they are already like, they are already like, you know, like, mm, num, num, num. Like moving their hands to get their, their fins together, like they are dabbing up each other in anticipation of how much, how many times they are gonna kill me on this challenge. Like, fuck, man. Out of all these small monsters, the Delix are like right up there with the Bullfangos. Um, always coming out of every nowhere to ruin your hunt. Like, they are just right up there. Oh, anyways, let's hope for the best. Let's immediately unlock this camp. Uh, let's see, is Kulu here? Oh, that's not Kulu. <laughs> oh. oh, I forgot the, the ration. Doesn't matter. Well, here we go.
Are you for real? I knew that rock was gonna be a problem. Like, what is that hitbox? Finally found it after asking Google Sensei. Nice. I wasted that one. Okay, let me chill a little bit. Uh. I need to sharpen. No way he's already dying. Wow. I almost died right there. <laughs> that would have been so hilarious. Oh, you motherfucker. You piece of... how you want to play this game, huh? I, 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 I say. Yeah. Uke tama wa imasu. Sore dewa. Motherfucker. Usa dango wa shifuku no hajibai. Itte rasai mase. Uke. Matte tai sore. Oishii yo ne. Ju Stupid ass rock and talking fried chicken. Oh, don't worry. I'm go I'm gonna get rid of the raw part. Don't worry. Oh, let me unlock this part of the map. Might as well.
I forgot the fraction second. Dang it. Uh, I gotta stop wasting mine. I see how it is. It, it's because it's because I want to farm him for the for the for that one particular uh, armor piece. I, I know that it's because of that. We did the black box of crimson boss rest. Oh god. Yeah. Wow, that's a point of this challenge that I'm gonna that I'm gonna hit. You were mentioning boss tracks, Jackson, but it suddenly hit me. Can I even fight the Ostra? Oh my god. Oh my god. I... I didn't even consider that. Can I even fight the Ostra? Because, uh, you gotta remember, guys, Hushala Blessing is a Sunbreak skill. And a pretty late Sunbreak skill at that. I do not get access to that skill. Neither for Vanilla the Ostra, nor for the, for the first, uh... Yeah, I don't get the access to that for the Vanilla the Ostras. Oh my god. Can I even fight him? Holy shit, well... That's still uh, kind of far away, so let's leave that problem for future me. Present me is having beef with some overgrown chicken over some cosmetics. <laughs> You could have it on, on the armor. Why? Why, you piece of... Oh, 
I tried myself and I think I Iron work with all IG attacks. Oh. Are you sure about like are you sure like in what in which way did you test it? Well, that wasn't as smooth as the previous one, but um, we're doing progress. Pull buff, first 161 no skill, second 210 with skill. And did that apply to, for example, if you try to do three aerial attacks uh, back to back, do they all three do the same damage? <laughs> wow. Dude didn't even hesitate pulling that thing off. Yes. Perfect. I gotta remember that he does that twice in a row when he's angry. Let this be, please let this be uh let this be uh, enough to get the waste piece. I only I only wanna craft his uh waste piece and that's it. That's what I need. Please, 
Wow, I wish all monsters could go this smooth. <laughs> Seven minutes. I wish all could go this smooth. Let's see. Come on. Waste, 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 waste. Yeah, baby! Woo! This is what I've been waiting for! Mm, nothing good on the rest of the armor, so I'm gonna ignore it. Same here. Same here. And now... Go to layer armor. There it is. Let's go. Sparabuba. 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 Let me check uh, his dog list. Because sometimes, uh, sometimes, uh, what's his name? Bulliaku has like decent early game uh, raw weapons. Exactly. Like, look at that. Look at that. Holy moly. That's so much better than the ones that I'm using. 10 more attack, a little bit more green sharpness, and 15% affinity. So much better, but it requires me to farm Kluyaku, uh -huh. which <laughs> I'm not doing. I won't bother farming monsters either until the end of the, the base game or until some break. I won't bother. Okay, let's go. You know what? He even has it in the name. Obnoxious, obnoxious lord. Like, this guy might as well be the most annoying of the options. <laughs> yup, it's Brock. No skills 690 with skill 890. Okay, I want you to do one last check, Danny. Uh, can you check if the diving wyvern is affected by that by that skill? Like, like all three hits, all three hits. Yeah. I think it. I think the diving wyvern does three ticks in the game. I don't remember. If it was three or two ticks, but point is, if every tick does that, does the same with with them, um, or if every tick is different, sorry, with them without the skill. Okay, let's see. Uh, this dude's intro. <laughs> Yeah, the Kinsai Thrust. That's a diving wyvern, man. They are literally the same thing. Oh god, I forgot this mod! <laughs> Okay, on paper, this guy should be easy. I'm practice. <laughs> oh my god, look, look at him with his hat. It's so cute. <laughs> And that's why this guy should be easy, because he has like the same attack pattern repeated over and over again. Drop poison tackle, drop poison tackle.
Poison Tackle. Tackle. Uh, oh, never mind. Oh. He was supposed to do an idle animation there. Oh, he didn't do it. What? I got stuck in a combo. Damn it. I was uh, spamming buttons. Oops. Whatever. This guy's gonna be easy, actually. He's wearing a hat. Yeah, dude. Like, I installed that, that mod as a joke just to show it on stream one day. And I forgot I left it there. <laughs> and because, you know, this guy's a low, like, low rank monster. I never saw it again after that specific day that I wanted to show them on. Oh, wow, my controller? It's drifting like crazy. <laughs> but dude, holy moly. The, the hat specifically in the intro was so hilarious. <laughs> Like it completely destroyed how menacing he he normally looks on that on that intro. Take the shortcut real quick. I forgot the rations, that's fine. I'm already getting used to this point. Oh, this is gonna be a so much worse spawn. Because, like, yeah, like his homies are here. Uh, whatever. Fuck me. Excellent start. Excellent start. Oh, that's a different combo. That's the combo that got me killed before. God bless that he didn't have a back hitbox out of nowhere there. I'm surprised that didn't touch me. I completely forgot he has that double swing. I like how, how because he keeps calling reinforcements, I'm casually farming the the camp unlock uh, quest. That killed it. his partner feels bad. Okay, let's recover some stamina. Gang, do you ever 
like use all your uh, backup? Keep tired. Oh. Oh. Oh, that tail was too close for comfort. No. Whatever. Oh, wow, he left. <laughs> hmm. So, Airborne actually works with every single aerial move of the Insect Clay? That's weird. I wonder if they change it at some point. After people like tested that it didn't work initially. And then like yeah, like someone just have never bothered retesting. Because I remember that everyone tested that thing. When it was when it appeared as a decoration and it was confirmed, like it didn't work. Oh, that's dangerous. No. Oh. oh my god, the warrior almost killed me. The the small one almost got me with a with a poison cloud and it was gonna be over. Uh there's a wire book here, no? Oh yeah. Yeah. I want a wire book. Mm. 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 Oh, never mind. I don't need no wire book no more. <laughs> Rip. Great Rogi and his awesome cowboy hat. Rest in peace, lad. Rest in peace. Bro, you have to see a setup play the jiggle mechanics so ridiculous. She jiggles on every move. Bro, I am so hyped with that game. That is different. Like, my friend who's a, who actually has a PS5, uh, he's, he has his, his copy pre order. Like, he's just waiting. And honestly, I'm just waiting with him. Like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna sit there and, and watch him play the shit out of that game. That game looks so similar with uh, to near Automata in so many aspects. That bro, oh my god! I, like you already know, like from the demo alone, you already know that game is gonna be so good. That's another one down. Oh, oh no! 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 Who you know? No! Anything but the rock, bitch! No! 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 Uh, uh, you guys remember when I said that the stream will probably end when I reach uh the urgent for the four star? Yeah, I lied. I think the stream is gonna end on this quest. Uh, fuck me. Godspeed. <laughs> uh, uh. <laughs> okay, let's do this. Let's do this. It can't be that hard. Like, on paper, right? Like, like let's be serious for a moment, okay? On paper. The only thing that I have to do different to how you usually play Rampage is that I have to be like proactive and move from one turret to another turret. Like the only thing that I should be doing different is moving between turrets so that the monsters don't like, you know, uh, la laser focus on my ass. On paper, that's that should be the difference. 
We'll see in practice in a couple of seconds, eh? We'll see. Oh god. I knew you had something that I wanted. My first two levels of the Vet Extender. Ah, oh, damn it! I'm gonna need a, another big. Yeah, I'm gonna need another big. Dang it! Whatever. Let's grab the first one, and then I'll. I'm just gonna run this guy because thankfully he's super easy. So I'll hunt another one and two points of Vet Extender. Dude, if it is tender, like, it's gonna be the best skill that I can get for this challenge. Like, I swear, when I when I get a uh, event extender 2, oh boy, it's gonna be so good. Event extender is so overpowered in this game. Glad you're feeling better, no more cough? Yeah, man, I, I think I mentioned this, uh, the first stream that I did where I wasn't coughing. I finally got a chance to go back to the doctor and well more like do the studies that I had to do right because I finally got the money for those and then I uh, I, I went back to the doctor and after he saw my studies he you know gave me a, a medical recite I don't know how you call that in English if that's a different term but yeah he gave me that and hey it worked instantly like the first pill that I swallow from from the recipe. Well, actually, I didn't swallow that pill. I ha I have to inhale it. As in, I have to put it in like a small device and crush it, and then I inhale the crush pill. Kind of weird, but whatever. Uh, I did that, and the moment I inhaled the first one, whew, cough no more. <laughs> and it's been now like three or four weeks since I've been following that treatment, and hey, I I even feel like I'm breathing better overall. Like, I genuinely need, did that. Need, needed that. The sad part is that uh, my studies revealed that um, it wasn't like a cough or a simple, like, you know, a simple sickness that I could, like, uh, you know, get medication and that's it. Cool. Prescription. Prescription. Yeah, that's the word. Exactly. A prescription. But yeah. Uh, it wasn't like a simple uh, sickness that I had, or like something that, that I catch. Uh, no, it's actually that I I suffer for, from a chronic uh, something. Don't remember the name, but I suffer from from a chronic sickness that, like every few every few years or months in my life, I'm gonna I'm gonna like go back and suffer from that thing that I that I had before with the coughing. Like every few 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 months or years of my life, I, 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 that that will keep coming back. So that sucks. That sucks, but uh, it is what it is. Hi for Ahmed. If I need the level two, I need to Ahmed in twice, right? Yeah. No, for Ahmed, you mean like the normal, not the custom ones? Uh, no, you're supposed to go for the. You're supposed to go for the next level. Whooping cough in English. Wait, really? That has like a like a term. Like a chronic. Uh, a chronic coughing like that. It's called. Damn. Yeah. I actually never knew that. Um. Oops, I almost forgot the music. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> さあ、次だ。うん、うん、うん、うん、うん、うん、うん。来るんだ。始めよう。いいか。使ってみよう。
見てるないいか Oh God <laughs> I know it's gonna go so wrong. Yeah, it affects your lungs and causing a chronic cough, which requires an asteroid prescription. Oh no, then then that whooping cough that you're mentioning it's it's a different thing because what I have is chronic, but it's not that strong to the point where I need a like an asteroid prescription. Because I got prescribed like a couple of things, but none of those are that. Like nothing, nothing that severe. Ah, doing that will reduce damage. Little do you know, what sushi. That literally, I can't use Gar because I will die through through it. <laughs> Wow, literally one version of the song to another version. Okay. Oh. <laughs> you can tell the panic that I that I have through this through this thing. Yeah, different level of medication. Fuck! I thought he was screaming because he arrived. I didn't saw the fireball in time. Oh god. Wow, this is gonna be something else. This is gonna be something else. Different levels of medication, precision can have a version of asteroid in it. I'm actually gonna check like the ingredients of the of the medication that I'm using. <laughs> Just to see about that. Because I got it's like I'm taking like three different like three different uh, products, right? One is like a uh, how is this called? Like a spray that I'm supposed to spray like uh, into my into my nostrils. One is a it's a normal pill, like one of those that you swallow with water, right? Wait! Don't tell me I have to go through for through the tutorial every time I cart. I'm gonna jump off a building. I'm gonna jump from this building. Ain't no way I have to do this tutorial every time I try. Oh my fucking god. Oh my god. I feel so crushed already. <laughs> uh, why? Big, big mistake. Oh 
my god. Eekanjida. Uh, <laughs> save me! <laughs> no! Ah, uh, yes, 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 shoot, 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 shoot! Shoot! Dude, why? Why I have to do this? Bro, this is not fair. That means I have to do this entire stupid thing. For, not only for, you know, for progression, but for my sanity, because... Imagine if I get stuck on this stupid quest like I did with the greatest sushi at the start. Holy moly. いいか。さあ、やってみよう。ね。しがみついて耐えるんだ。いい感じだ。よくやったぞ。やいかもん。さあ、やってみよう。頼んだよ。気にならできる。さあ、頼んだよ。気にならできる。さあ、頼んだよ。気にならできる。さあ、頼んだよ。気にならできる。さあ、頼んだよ。気
Oh my god. Okay, here comes the big body. Come on, guys, you can do this. Bro, this is so hard! Dude! I can't... I can't stand on this thing! Stop targeting me, you piece of... Yes, finally got the stun. Let's go. We are halfway through. Let me build! Kurunda. Oh my god. There's so much stuff that I want to do in this tutorial, it's so disrupting. Paro paroxymal cough can be caused by post nasal ah. drip, which is the spray for your nose. The two pills can be antibiotic to fight infection, the triple can be a form of sturdy to prevent. <laughs> prevent damage to your lungs. Paroxysmal. I'm gonna I'm gonna check that. As I, as I said before, I'm gonna check the the, the recite for each stuff that I'm taking. To see what's what's up. Tanon I didn't have enough time. Uh, whatever. We are raw dog in this. Ooh, they're right, idiots.
Um... Oh, this bird. <clears throat> Dude, this is so annoying. My controller is drifting like a little bit more than usual. And now I, I can't aim <clears throat> properly. Like I have to I have this the, the other joystick and I'm not used to aim like that. God dang it. Okay, okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. This is it. We're doing it, baby. I fucked up again. I got him mid jump. Come on. Since that what I just said before it stands. As long as I try to be proactive, you know, um move around the, the turret instead of trying to stand my ground. Isn't that as as long as I do that, we are good to go. This whoops. This won't be as bad as it seems. Nice. Nice. Oh boy, wait a minute. Let me pause the music. We gotta see Dean drop that boy. Yeah. Ita. It's the tail and ears that makes you better. <laughs> it's Luna. Before she was fighting at 50% power, but now she's 100%. She's full power now. <laughs> oh boy. There's Maggie. <laughs> Dude. Not gonna lie. I have mentioned countless times through my streams and whatever. Like how much I don't like Magna Malo. Not because of the design, because he's like really awesome in design and concept and all that. But I just don't like the animation of his um his attacks that make him, you know, jump through the air and when he flies, like he looks super goofy. But despite that, I genuinely hope that Magna Malo becomes a recurring like returning monster for the for the franchise like i hope that we see him a lot more i it, like it would it would it will suck a lot if, if, if he gets the the like yakus treatment where we will where we barely see him it will generally suck him and malcino are like the two monsters from this entire roster like of new monsters right from summer and rise that I hope that we that we see the Nalot moving forward. Some monster no na wa onkoryu, magai magado. Hyakuryu yako to tomo ni araware, sono mure o kurau bakemono. Think he's a mass on fight. Yeah, dude, yeah, dude. Like man, man, again. Like I like his everything. The only thing that I don't like 
it's as I say how goofy he looks when he does his flying dash moves or when he like when he has like a turf wall with the other dragons and they start flying like Max Malo looks so stupid flying I have commented before that when Magnamado flies in that turtle animation, he looks like someone is dragging him on an editing program. Like someone is dra is like uh, someone is like dragging him with the mouse <laughs> in an editing program. Like he looks so bad when he's flying. But outside of that, oh man, he's so good. <laughs> it sucks when you lower level to fight him. We'll see. I mean, I'm, I'm kind of close to them. <laughs> we'll see how much it sucks. We'll see how much it sucks. Uh... <laughs> Doing Magna Malo. The progression Magna Malo at 1 HP and only 1 point. Wait, what? You will for sure need a bit extended for him. You already know about that, bro. You already know that. <laughs> Thankfully, I'm only uh, one great rocky beak away from getting a from getting a... what's the word that I'm looking for? from getting a bad extender too and in fact uh, I was gonna end the stream here but instead uh, what I'm gonna do is that I'm actually gonna go for that for that upgrade I'm gonna, I'm gonna grab it right now let me check something real quick Wow, that build that I'm gonna have is gonna be so perfect. Literally a couple of points of constitution to help with the stamina, and then two points of event extender so that I can finally like dance around the monsters more comfortably. Oh wow, the rampage upgrades. I forgot those are our thing. Sadly, I won't be using this uh like, these are useless to me. The only one that might be worth it, I just, re oh, I just remember that one now. You know which one will be worth it? When I eventually uh, unlock Tigrex. Tigrex upgraded with the Silkbind boost. That might be good. I don't know. I'm gonna actually have to do, like, uh, for tomorrow's stream, I'm gonna do a little bit of research. I'm actually gonna do a little bit of research on the meta for duoblis in the base game to see what I should be aiming for because I said it before, I completely lost and completely lost, I just have a big idea anyways, uh, where is this dude? is there another quest with him? just in case? no? okay let's run it back I need to break his face So did you get the scarf? Looks cool. Uh, it's a mod, Gunyan. I'm, I'm sorry, bro. It's a mod for, for PC. What do they... Oh, there we go. More great wire box. Yay! Yo! yo! Does that mod apply to the male character? Yes, the mod applies to both. Bro, to get that scarf in ward is dead. Low. I mean, is it that hard? Like, if I remember correctly, to get this scarf, that's an like event quest where you find a uh, Belkana and a. Uh, uh, it's a Belkana and is it a normal Barfasak or is it a Black Veil? I don't remember. I believe that's the quest, no? 
Like, you gotta hunt Belkana and Black Bale, Bahasaka, or normal Bahasaka, I don't remember now. Black Bale. Yeah, okay, yeah, it's, it's the Black Bale one. I'm okay. God bye, Jay. <laughs> oh, dude, I just want to finish the string with the upgrade, with my latest armor upgrade. I don't think I'm asking for much. Come on, come on, dude, come on. Oh great, now he's in a worse place. Cool. God, why is front deal so drag so fucking good? Like I swear to god. Captain usually never misses with their soundtracks, but damn, Frontier was a different animal, man. Why is the music from that game so good? Uh, where the fuck is he? Oh, hello. Bro, his stupid hat is so cute. I love it. Uh, I couldn't get the knife on his head. That's unfortunate. Oh, the fish. I forgot the fish. I forgot I gotta watch out for the fish. Can you post the link to the layer armor? Uh, yeah. Let me finish this quest and I can... I can give you a link. But if you wanna search search for it in the meantime, uh... Because it's not that, that uh, complicated of a name. You can search a Nexus mod for Sealed, sealed Dragon Club. And you should find it instantly. <laughs> ah, if it extend her. If it extend her. There we go. <clears throat> Let me grab this wire box. <laughs> I thought it was gonna do something else. Whoa, we better extend her, dude. I only have one level, if it's and it's already so noticeable, dude. I feel so sad when we go uh, into wilds, and the better extender is nowhere near as broken as it is in this game. 
Oh! Get back here! Whatever. Please tell me he's gonna be sleeping. Perfect. No, no, I'm the <laughs> oh, thank God he died. Dude, I was panicking so hard. Because, dude, you're seeing the rogues, right? That, that they all got there. If any of them, like, uh, you know, launch at me, it was over. It was so over. Oh, my God. Okay. Now I just need that, uh, because I broke his face, I just need that drop. Like a big drop, and we are good. Let me grab this while I'm at it, like might as well. Come on. I really don't want to fart monsters at this point in the game, I'm just... Uh, I'm just doing an exception, because event extender is... Such a core skill for this challenge. Like, I really need that extra evade distance. Okay, there we go. That second level of your extender is ours. By the way, Nguyen, uh, do you want, like, are you asking only for the scarf, a scarf or are you asking for, like, the entire armor? Mm. Since you're asking like for the layer armor in general. There it is. And there we have it. And there we have it. There it is. Three points of constitution, two points of an extender, one point in Wild Whisper. I literally need nothing else, like for the rest of the base game, I need nothing but to max these skills. Actually, Event Extender, I don't really need Event Extender 3, that's kind of overkill. But Event Extender 2 is enough, I need to keep that Event Extender 2 around. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so woof. Uh, for tomorrow, we're gonna be fighting Tetradon, Royal Ludrod, and then moving forward into into the four star quests. Which I just remember now. Uh, is it four star quest like the end of the village? And then we go into the uh, to the thing only for the scarf. Oh, okay. Uh, let me, uh, like uh, as I just mentioned, that's gonna be all the gameplay for today. So let me change screens while the stream ends and I get uh, Nguyen the links that he asked me for. So yeah, guys, uh, thank you for dropping by. I hope that you enjoyed my suffering. And a uh, reminder, this suffering will continue a stream right here on YouTube. Wednesdays through Saturdays. Every day, same hour, which is 4 p.m. AST. I'm gonna be streaming this challenge. So yeah, uh, now let me grab the, the mods real quick. Oh, whoops.
Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Okay, there we go. Um, where's my chat? Ooh, let me double check. Give me a second. I'm gonna uh, let me double check my chat settings. Oh, <laughs> uh, that's exactly what I wanted. Moderation, none. Okay, okay, good. I had to double check that uh, that I can do this. Uh, there you go, there you go, Angunian bro. That's uh, that's the sealed uh, dragon skull. Apart from the good old uh, sealed dragon skull from most of the world. So yeah, there you go, buddy. And yeah, well guys, um, oh god, wow, I needed that stretch, anyways, that's gonna be it guys, and as I said, I'll see you all tomorrow, or whenever you can come back, peace.